What's up, you guys? This is Divine Messenger 33, where I get messages from the Divine. I give them straight to you guys. Clearing out any energy that will not benefit this message. Holy Spirit, Archangel Michael, my ancestors, my spirit guides of my highest good, please come in and protect me as I channel this current energy for the collective of the Divine Feminines. Ancestors of my highest good, please give me clear and accurate messages. All right, Divine Feminine, let's see what's going on with you. Okay. Divine Feminine, let's see what's up. Messages for Divine Feminine Spirit. Messages for Divine Feminine. feminine spirit deception and envy of course divine feminine you got people jealous of your foundations and achievements and shit but you you know that you know that divine feminine okay what else so you got some sneaky ass energy around you at this time yeah so there could be people jealous of your light here all right really jealous of your light <clears throat> people that you could have lost emotion for all right we have fertility empress one more for divine feminine all right we have shadow that was like that and we have suffering in silence was like that okay bottom of the deck we have intuition which is like the high priestess card so Basically, what I'm getting is somebody is jealous of your light. Okay, for some of y'all, could be a mother. All right. For some of you guys, uh, you could have somebody in a shadow side that could be suffering in silence at this time in your energy. This could be the person that's jealous of you. All right. So, this could be the person that's jealous of you. See, I could pick shit up better with my long nails. <laughs> All right, let's see. All right, spirit, let's get into the energy for the divine feminine. What is this deception and envy for divine feminine? What is this deception and envy for divine feminine? All right, Ten of Cups, of course. For some of you guys, if you have a family, you could have somebody very jealous of your family and you being happy. For some of you guys, this is a person in your family. This person could be an Aquarius or a Cancer. Yeah, Three of Swords or a Gemini, okay? This person could be really in their head about Either your new love, your love life, or this person could just be in their head about a new project that you could just love, okay? I feel like that for some of y'all, this new project could have got you out the uh, five of pentacles or a wheel, like in a lack energy. And whoever this person is could be very like upset about that. This could be a person that um, uh, you broke up with, okay, in a situation, or for some of y'all, you could have kicked this person out if this was like a roommate or something like that. All right. Yeah, I spit the deck on Seven of Swords again. So definitely a lot of deception and envy in your energy for real. Okay. Clarify the light for Divine Feminine. Knight of Cups. Yep, King of Swords. All right. For some of you guys, um, I feel like that you could have, you could be very like straightforward at this time. For some of y'all, you could be like in that King of Swords energy. You could be like really choosing like logic over emotions in a situation. Okay. For some of you guys, you could be about to birth something when it comes to your, um, your, uh, your project. All right. You about to birth something new. All right. We got Empress out here twice. So for some of you guys, you could be pregnant. Okay. Or you could just be about to like 
burst open with something new. Okay, for some of you guys, you could be, uh, somebody could feel in your energy that you're being real cold to them or something like that. This could be somebody that's, that wants you or something like that. There could be somebody like a secret admirer even, all right, that could fuck with you. But somebody could be like intimidated by you because you could be in this King of Swords energy. Like you could be like straight cutthroat, straightforward, very logic, very just, you know, <laughs> all right in a situation but somebody could be just somebody could really fuck with you like for real but somebody is moving slow with trying to plan shit with you all right <laughs> okay but somebody find you very attractive and shit like that somebody could find you very uh determined and stuff for some of y'all this could be the person that you with you could be with your divine counterpart this person really look up to you whether you know it or not all right, for some of y'all, this could be a, a very romantic person, if you with this person or not. If this person, whoever this person is that's in your energy, this lover, this person could be very, like, logic, very serious. But with you, it's like this person just, like, they turn into, like, a little softy a little bit <laughs> when it come to you. It's like they give everybody else that, you know, that cold front. But then when it come to you, it's like, you know, I just want to, you know, baby this, baby that, flowers and all this other shit, okay? <laughs> For some of y'all, this this person that you with, you're going to get pregnant by this person. Something to do with a Gemini, Libra and Aquarius, Cancer, okay? Strong Aquarius energy, Cancer energy, okay? You're going to get pregnant by this person, y'all. Hell yeah. But your magician skills is on bing bing, all right? So make sure you are manifesting the things that you want, all right? Because it's almost like you got, like, the Midas touch. So you got to be careful not to be manifesting shit you don't want, okay? <laughs> all right. Clarify this fertility for Divine Feminine. All right. Four of Swords. Yeah, Queen of Cups. Yeah, I'm seeing that you guys could be in that very loving energy. And I feel like that if you are pregnant, okay, yo, Divine don't want you to be working too hard. Yeah, we got Ten of Wands. For some of you guys, you could be overworking, especially if you're pregnant. All right, you, you're doing too much. Okay, your foundation is secure at this time. For some of you guys, you could be uh, about to start something new. All right, that's going to create even more abundance. But the divine don't want you to do nothing too hard, okay? Because with you being an empress, I mean, you always going to be looked out for. You know what I'm saying? But you don't have to overdo it. I think I told y'all that last week. Maybe some of y'all ain't motherfucking listening, okay? <laughs> some of y'all working too hard. That's what divine is saying. You doing too much. For some of y'all, you could be pregnant and you could be... It's okay to work hard, but you don't have to, like, overdo it, though. Like, that's what I'm seeing for some of y'all. You could be really in that energy where you just, ooh, ooh. you know what I'm saying? You like, <laughs> for some of y'all, you got like four, five different hustles, jobs, all kind of shit. Like, <laughs> okay. Yeah, you got a lot on your shoulders and shit. Okay. Is what I'm saying. So the vibe don't want you like doing too much. You know what I'm saying? It's like, this four of swords, it says you earn this rest. So whatever you earn this, okay? So it's okay to like take a little break. You know, sometimes I do it. You know, I take a little break because I get readings on this channel and my other channel. So, and then I post on both channels too. So it's like, sometimes I be needing a day. Of, <laughs> you know, I, I be needing to get my, you know what I'm saying, rejuvenate myself you know what i'm saying so don't like feel like you gotta like overdo it okay don't feel like you gotta overdo it okay clarify the shadow oh yeah high priestess that fell on the empress yeah you already know you already know this divine feminine i don't know why you fucking playing <laughs> You already know you just ain't listening. That's for somebody. Somebody ain't listening because it's coming out. So somebody is not listening. 
Okay. Clarify the shadow for Divine Feminine. Six of Cups. Horrifying. All right. For some of you guys, there's a person from your past that's really going through their shadow side at this time. Somebody could be even seek it, seeking like counseling of some sort. All right. This could have been a person where they could have been abusive to you or something like that. All right. But somebody, whoever this person is, they could be trying to hurry up and come in with some shit. All right. Yeah, to try to make you self-doubt yourself in a situation. But don't do that, though. Okay? So there's somebody from your past that this person could be trying to seek some kind of help or some, sh of some shape or form. But, you know, this person could be trying to, like, rush the process on, on what they have going on. They need to take their damn time. But for some of y'all, you're not fucking with this person anyway. But this person is showing up in your energy. All right. Okay. For some of y'all, somebody is going to try to come back and get you to go back to your old ways. Get, you know, try to get you to go back to ways that you had before and shit like that. But for a lot of you guys, I feel like that you have went through your shadow side. You know, that's why you in this higher fine energy. All right. You're very high vibrational. You, you know, you've learned a lot of shit. Okay. And I feel like that somebody from your past is going to try to get you to like guilt, go back into old ways. All right. For some of you guys, somebody is going to try to get you pregnant for, for financial security. Somebody could feel like that you are a good luck charm or some shape or form. So somebody could be trying to come in and um like get you pregnant for security. And I feel like for some of you guys, it's going to put you in your head here. Okay, if this does happen. So definitely listen to your intuition. All right, about this situation, okay? Because you, you have a lot of choices that's coming towards you for prosperity with somebody. So just be very careful, okay, in the situation here. Divine Feminine. Whoever this person is in your family, they mad as hell. Or for some of y'all, this is a person you had got a family with. And this person, maybe you could have divorced this person or something like that. Whoever this person is looking at you, like in deception and envy, this person could have really, really hurt you. Like really did some fucked up shit. But they like watching you like be happy and shit like that. Divine Feminine. Calling in your soulmate is in the reverse. For some of y'all, you, you, <laughs> you ain't calling in nobody. Yeah. But the, whoever this person is, you know, this past person, they want you to give them a chance, but you not, yeah, un, unrequited love right behind that. You ain't fucking with this. Yeah. But for some of y'all, this person feel like y'all got chemistry and they going to try to get you to, uh, like go away with them or something like that for some of y'all. So some of y'all, somebody is going to come in your energy and want to like present some kind of trip, try to get you to go on a trip with them or something like that. All right. So if it doesn't only take or resonate, whatever don't resonate, just leave it. Okay. Leave it. If it don't resonate. Okay. So we got Aquarius, strong Aquarius, Cancer, Libra. Okay. Strong Cancer energy and Aquarius and Libra. Gemini, Pisces, Taurus. Okay. Yeah. Now that's why I'm seeing y'all this, this and shit. They be doing the most divine feminine. Feminine. 
Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine. Divine Feminine. All right, so somebody could love wearing joggers, okay? Or somebody could wear joggers to work or something like that. We have kind panties. We have four. Somebody could have a four-year-old, something to do with the Aries. Coffee, so somebody could love Starbucks. Okay, right leg and their thigh tattoos. Native American. Somebody could love wearing like lipsticks and stuff like that. Natural hair. X-Con, fur coats, white socks, printed tops, singer, somebody could be brown skin tone, we have T, M, motorcycle and or dirt bike, Head wraps, neck tattoos. Somebody could love drinking beer. We have do rag, mechanic, 60s, dark hair, community service, short, straight hair. We have doctor, Vicky. Somebody could be real thick, short eyelashes, nurse, colored hair. We have R, J, that air sign of hater, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Jamaican, and we have model, all right? Okay, so somebody could have a junior. Okay, somebody could have a junior. All right. Somebody could be four months pregnant or somebody could have four months to go. All right, in their situation. Something with Montana. Something with RJ, something with Timothy, Tom. Okay, JT, MJ, Jermaine, I'm hearing, Tanaya, Jackson, okay, something with Monet, okay, I'm just hearing Monet, okay. Okay. All right, you guys, I'm going to leave it there. I really hope this helped you like, comment, and subscribe. Look in the description box below for any other information about me with the services that I provide. And with that, you guys, peace and love.